G'day guys, it's Dan here, and I thought I'd do something a bit different this week. Uh, the truth is it's my wife's birthday tomorrow, it's her 50th birthday, and I've got a lot of present wrapping to do, and then we're taking a few days off this week to go and celebrate. But I didn't want to miss out on the posting schedule of giving you a video every week, and so I thought I'd share something that I recently did for Sony that was a kind of retrospective of my career, to give any of you who haven't really known me very long a bit of a sense of where I've come from, what kind of projects I've worked on. And even though we now focus you know, on, um, on coaching filmmakers and business, I wanted to share with you my pedigree, if you like, kind of where I've been, what I've done, to give you some context around some of the things we talk about. Now, um, there's a whole heap of different things here. And what I'm going to show you is actually the first part of a five-part series that I've produced for Sony. But if you find it interesting and you think it's useful and you would like to see more, then let me know in the comments below. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications bell if you wouldn't mind, if you want to keep seeing these uh, notifications. I'll be pushing out a piece of content every single week and uh, I need you guys to hold me to account. So make sure you let me know in the comments if you want to see more content like this. And um, here's the first piece of the puzzle, which is really an overview of uh, kind of my career to give you some context of what I've done in my career in terms of how that can help you build your business. Because I've, I've been around a little while, I've done a lot of different things, and uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Enjoy. Hey guys, uh, I'm Dan and I am here to share some insights with you based on my background in film and television. So if you don't know who I am and you haven't come across me before in my work, um, I'm a filmmaker who has been doing this for almost three decades. I've been fortunate enough to travel all over the world, I think something like 55, 60 countries now. And in that time I've worked in a broad range of roles starting off in broadcast television as a sound recordist, as a fresh-faced boy in 1994, and moving on to work as a cameraman, and then as a producer, and as a director of photography, working across a range of different programming, from travel to entertainment to documentary, and then moving into the freelance world, and in that time, having an incredible journey through all sorts of genres of work. And I've had the opportunity to work with some pretty famous people as well. Robbie Williams, Duran Duran, Cristiano Ronaldo, and filmed in countries such as Australia, Scotland, Istanbul, Asia, spoken at events all over the world, and had an amazing journey as a filmmaker. I've also produced multiple films for Sony, including the A7S launch film, which we filmed in Scotland and Japan, uh, the FS7 launch film, which we filmed in Japan, the FS5 launch film that we filmed in Sydney, Australia. I've worked on the A7S Mark III film that we made just last year here in Australia. And my initial career started in the UK uh, until 2015 when my wife and I moved to Australia to just live a different lifestyle. I think one of the things that is beneficial as a filmmaker is it's a, it's a skill you can take anywhere in the world. Nowadays I'm focused very much on coaching filmmakers in how to run better businesses but I still am involved in production from time to time and over the last you know nearly 26 years I've worked across a whole broad range of productions and I've been involved in lots of different types of projects and so what I wanted to do was share some of that with you today show you a number of different types of projects and give you some lessons and sharings that I think will benefit you. So first of all, we're going to look at a behind the scenes of a drama production. And drama is not something I typically work on, but I got the opportunity to work with a very accomplished Hollywood director. And so we created a short film in the UK. And then I'm going to talk about planning and pitching ideas to clients and how you can pre-visualize ideas so that clients and, and stakeholders who might be investing in a project get a sense of what it is you're trying to achieve. 
Then I'm going to talk about the importance of collaborating with other filmmakers. You know, I don't believe filmmaking is a solo pursuit. It can be something you can do alone, but I think when you collaborate with other filmmakers, you end up with a, a film which is greater than the sum of its parts. And then finally, I'm going to share some insights and tips and tricks on how working with bigger name celebrities can be a really amazing springboard for your career, but also that what is that actually like in practice? So I'm going to share some insights with you on some projects I've worked with, some well-known celebrities and some bigger projects to give you some perspective on how you can perhaps take some of those tips and apply them in your own filmmaking. So thank you for watching. I hope that you get an enormous amount of value out of this um, series. If you want to find out more about me, you can find me at denlenny.com. So I hope you enjoy this video series. So I hope you found that useful, interesting. Uh, if you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, feel free to give me a thumbs down and make sure and subscribe. And let me know in the comments if you'd like to see the other four videos released in this series. And I'll maybe put them out over the next few months and tease them out piece by piece. As always, thanks for watching. See you next week.